Shopkeepers became the target, as well as Fox 40's Lonnie Wong, who was attacked by the swarm. Lonnie's in the news center now, and how are you doing, Lonnie? Well, it's still kind of painful. You can see my face is still kind of uh, puffed up, and uh, that's because I was stung at least half a dozen times, probably more during this episode. And, of course, it's hard not to panic in a situation like that, and here's why. This is what folks on Brook Hill Drive had to deal with. The bees were aggravated by beekeeper Ron Kahn, whose job was to remove at least six hives wedged in the walls of this vacant house. Even with protective gear, it was a chore. Tough job? Uh, very tough. I've got stung probably 40 times in the last two days. Which means I didn't have a chance after one of the shortest interviews I've ever done. Sheriff's deputies were called after some residents couldn't leave their homes. After getting stung, get in the car, right? Well, angry bees will follow you there. After a while, it's tough to figure out exactly how many times I've been stung. I got one underneath the eye, one on the nose here. At one point, bees were actually flying up my nostrils and into my ears. But I wasn't finished. I had to find out what neighbors thought. Oh, we want them out of here. It, and that house is a is a mess. But the bees didn't want to <laughs> let me do my job. I don't know if it's the sunscreen that I have on me, or once I get stung, the bees <laughs> sort of kind of target me, but I'm a block and a half away from the house, and they're still after me. <laughs> Elena wanted to end the interview, but not because she was in danger. You better stop. Oh. You're going to get it. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm, okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Now, that was a bit of a fib because I wanted to complete the interview, but uh, uh, as you can tell, it was a very harrowing experience. Oh, I bet. Lonnie, we were talking in the newsroom, and you said you weren't feeling so well, even though your face is uh, its still a little swollen, not as bad as right after that. Right, right. And, uh, you know, what really gets to you is when yeah. they start going into your hair and you start swatting at them, it might have looked pretty funny at the time, but uh, yeah. it was no joke. Uh, you're not allergic to bees. No, yeah. no, I'm not. But, uh, again, still... They still tender and puffy. All right. Thanks a lot, Lonnie. We we're saying took one for the team today. If you ever find yourself in a situation like Lonnie and those beekeepers, here's what you should do. Run. The longer you hang around, the more you'll get stung. Cover your head with just about anything, like a jacket, okay? And get inside as quick as possible, quickly as possible. Also, do not swat them. That just confirms to them that you're a threat. And if you're stung multiple times, go to the doctor immediately.